open mind and optimistic when you talk to other people listening to their ideas and opinions, or pessimistic and dismissive? Well, what kind of mindset do you think benefits us as individuals and collectively as a human race? Welcome aboard. Look at these, look at this gorgeous pair here. This is Alba and Ajay, my lovely friends. And we've just been out for an absolutely fantastic lunch together. Lots of mixtures yeah. of different bits and pieces, haven't we? Yes, it's, it's, yes. It's, it's the real um, smorgasbord of mixture. Lots of, yeah, delicious little tapas. Oh, it's just the best way to eat. But we've been having such a wonderful conversation because there's a big age difference here. I'm in my 50s, these guys are in their 20s, full of life and optimism for the future and I could be there. I could say the same for you. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, I, I just, was just going to say. <laughs> and this is the whole thing, so I'm going to let these guys speak because I'm speaking too much, but <laughs> the whole idea is I could be the cynical something, 50 year olds, these could be the, you know, well you don't know what you're talking about, you old bugger. But it's not been like that at all, is it? Not really? at all. Not no. at all. Yeah. It's very nice meeting someone who is also very open-minded and understanding and very open to hear other people's opinions yeah and values your opinion even though you're young because that is something that i think i i at least have come across in a lot of situations that people because you're young kind of dismiss your point of view or your opinion or yeah yeah <laughs> and the person it has isn't it and the, and the lovely thing is that these guys have asked me questions about alba actually supports me so a lot of these videos are put together by Alba. She's been leading me down the path I had absolutely no idea about because of her interest. And Ajay's uh, into that market as well. But what what has been lovely for me, again, is that they've asked me my opinion and my experiences and how I felt in those particular scenarios. And for me, I feel I felt really valuable today. And I think you know they, these guys have taught me something. And the important thing is that we're here I am big in spirituality, emotional connection. And you guys, together, we're just making such a difference. We inspire each other. I mean, there's no divide. But, oh, but you were talking about the, the hundreds. What was, what was yeah. That? yeah, the documentary on Netflix about Live to 100 and how in one of the places, a very big part of it is how everyone kind of learns from each other, including the younger generations from the older generations and having that the older generations have that sense of purpose because they feel like they're giving value and younger generations see it as a learning opportunity and yes, to grow from, grow from and learn from others' experiences which led into another part of our conversation about how you don't have to learn it all yourself. You can learn from other people's experiences and kind of have that under your belt as well. And then, yeah, just kind of grow from that. Yeah, it's, and, the, yeah. it's the storytelling. It doesn't need to be somebody owes somebody's any any specific story that's, mm -hmm. that we know about. It's using other people's experiences, yeah. bringing it in that make that bring the, the whole context, the whole whole abstract idea comes alive when we talk about those stories. No, I mean, yeah. we've all had different backgrounds, but yeah. it's such an yeah. inclusive yeah, thing. It's, it's nice to see how the. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly, yeah, how similar backgrounds or very different backgrounds can lead to similar point of views or how one thing, two people that see it so differently, that it can be a value to each other. Absolutely. And it's that, in fact, actually, you were talking about it, you were struggling with your friends, weren't you, in talking about and the Andrew Tate thing, is the fact that you, yeah, it's, it's going to be polarising, but if you get polarised by it, you don't listen to the other side of the argument. Mm -hmm. So you were, you were saying how frustrating it was that you could have a debate about it. I think that's yeah. important. Listen. Listen. That's yeah. what it comes down to, really. It does, it? Well, it's been brilliant. And for me, I think the message is inclusivity. It doesn't matter where you come from. Age, yeah. race, yeah. colour of skin. It's all about inclusivity. So. Absolutely. Anyway, guys, listen. That's, that's for me, the most important thing. Look after each other. Connect with each other. In the meantime, keep it in the greens. <laughs> Just in the greens. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Cheers. Bye.